I got a video that I want to show you that was sent to me by a fellow activist. This is from the JSO, the Jacksonville Sheriff's Office, which you guys know Jeff Gray runs into all the time out there in uh, Northern Florida. This is uh, a very disturbing video and I want you guys to check it out and uh, feel free to mirror Brittany's video. Her name's Brittany Williams. This is her video that she edited. She got a copy of this in Discovery. She's got criminal charges against her. And uh, she and her husband are uh, filmmakers and they did a brilliant job editing this. So without further ado, here you go. I've got some commentary at the end of this video. Is that her gun or is it yours? I don't know. I don't even live here. I don't know whose gun it is. This is my it's first little, time here in the It's a little neon thing. green pistol. It's probably hers. It's, she's probably allowed to have it. My sister's always walked the straight and narrow. She's always done everything by the book. Yeah, she's she doesn't have a record. At all. Yeah. At all. That's why we're wondering Baby why she acted speed. out like this. Baby don't even speed. I'm trying to tell y'all. So yeah. I'm, I'm, I'm over here pissed off because I'm the one that usually goes to jail. You know, I'm, I'm the one that's usually in custody. Yeah. I'm the one that's like, oh, shit. Right, right, that's right. That's me. But yeah. She's not like that. So I'm trying to figure out what the fuck y'all did to so we just can't go into your home. We can't go into your home without a warrant. But we, we can't go into your home without a warrant. Yes. Y'all beat her and knock her teeth out? No, ma'am. So, we did that on the door. So, I walk up to her, she runs from me, she slaps her fucking face in the door. But she's hey, y'all, he's not me! Hey, oh, she did that on the door. Slaps her fucking face in the door. Maybe she did that on the door. Maybe she did that on the door. She has on her face on the spoon on me in the car. What's she throw on you? What did she throw on you? At no point in time did we ever punch, hit, strike, bite, nothing of her. Officer Paget is my name. In. 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 Inside, go somewhere. Unless you want to be a witness to it. You don't understand. And no, you don't. And if you don't want to, con if you continue to not want to help us, then we'll just put all that down too. Come on, brother. We'll go in there with you. Okay. I mean, bro, I don't. I just can't. I just wait till some more people get here. I don't want to go in there with y'all. If you don't mind, I'm sorry. 
Brother, th we, this has all been recorded the entire time. Nothing is going to happen to you. No, you didn't throw me on ground, but you have to understand I'm scared. I'm just, please. So, this was all backed up over here. It's a 2331 on here. Is that what, it, what you need? Or you need the tag number? So I just need the number to phone So I backed into the driveway right here and started reading emails. So she comes out of the house, knocks on the on my window, and says, Sir, huh? Why not? I'm out of the roadway. And there's... And there's, there's, it, it's the only reason why I sat here is because all this shit was backed up because of the crash. Or you need the tag number. So I just need the number to call the five. Two, three, three, one. The only reason why I sat here is because all this shit was backed up because of the crash. Yeah, but why? why just why, reading emails. But why does it have to be in our you're, you're, This guy was sitting right here the whole here. time. Yeah. Have you been out here for a hot minute? Just a few minutes. Just a few minutes. Did you see the young lady throw that uh, object at the officer? While he was sitting there in his car? No, I did. Okay. All right. All these people were across the street the whole time. Yeah. Which one do you find General was out here the whole time listening to this nonsense? How's it going? Huh? How's it going? What's going on, Hey. We're going to ignore a little drinking and stuff going on over here. I just need to, I need to know who was, who was observing and listening to this mess over here. Huh? But I know the three of y'all been in here, been over here the whole time. Huh? 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 Oh, you weren't listening to her yelling and carrying on over there. I hear the hollering when y'all over there, but I don't know what's going on. Problem is 5035 Get those drinks and clear out. So I, I backed into the driveway right here and started reading emails. It says, Sir, huh? Why not? No. No, I just, I just backed in here to look at some emails. No. Now that was, um, that was Lieutenant. Oh, I just, I just backed in here to look at some emails. I got out of the car and he was out here the whole time. Just be sure. Write your narrative, and I there's no real examples on it. I did not activate my camera immediately because I was not anticipating citizen reaction. Right. I pulled up here real quick after completing the call. But I mean, if you're gonna do that stuff and, and that carry on like that, then you get it. It's not illegal to have a firearm, but what I mean, mean, but when you call police to threaten the police. Call the police. Now how that she sound? Called she called the police. She called Ma'am, it's on her Ma'am, she didn't have it in her hand. She's did. so littered. She did. She's so littered. She did. 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 She she ran back here, and there was a gun right where homeboy is standing. Right where homeboy is standing. Right where homeboy is standing. The reason why she's not alive is because she didn't reach for it when we were there. Oh my god. So what, so what you're saying is she's not supposed to have her gun in her house? If she's reaching for a gun in an argument with an but officer... she didn't though, right? The reason why she's not alive is because she didn't reach for it. with an officer. she didn't though, right? And she throws a spoon with some sort of liquid on it Spokes on him. Spoon. With a liquid sir, on it. Sir, that we, don't we, sound like Britain. Just be sure when you write your narrative, I did not activate my camera immediately. Okay, well we have the spoon. And, and we have the liquid. On. Hey, what, what ma'am, kind of ma'am, right here. And here's the thing, the, the reality. Can I see what's on it? No, don't touch it. Don't touch it, okay? But what, what, what's what on it? Was. What's on it? I don't, I don't know. We don't know. Is it a drug? No, not, she's not that type of child. Okay. What's on it? I don't know. We don't know. Is it a drug? No, it was obvious to her face stuff, but... What's on it? I don't know. No, it was obvious to her face stuff, but... We don't know. Is it a drug? No, it was obvious to her face stuff, but... I mean, if you're going to do that stuff and, and carry on like that, then you get it. So she was fighting y'all? Correct. What, what happened? 
to why she had to feel like she had to fight somebody. What happened? Why she felt like she had to fight somebody? I was the one. I was the one that she threw this at. What did she throw at? A spoon. With whatever substances is on it, ma'am. This is what happened. Your sister came up to my car, asked if I needed any help. She came up to my car and started throwing and threatening me. Your sister came up to my car, asked if I needed any help. I explained to her that I didn't, that I would be done very shortly. She said, I want you out of my driveway. And I said, ma'am, I'll be done in just so a couple where minutes. You right there. So you were parked in our driveway? In the okay. driveway, yes, ma'am. All right, go ahead. What happened? So I explained to your sister that I'd be leaving in, in a couple seconds. She said, I want you out of my driveway now. And threw this spoon at me that hit me in the forearm with whatever green substance it was on. Were you in the car? Or I was outside? inside my car. And she threw in the spoon, made it in the car? Yes, through the window the that I'd substance? opened to talk to her. With the substance on it? Yes. Okay. Were you in the car? Or I was outside? inside my car. And she threw in the spoon, made it in the car? Yes, through the window with that the I'd substance? opened to talk to her. With the substance on it? Yes. Okay. Did he ever say why he came or anything? No, he just started yelling at me. I asked, I said, hi, officer, can I help you? And he started yelling at me, talking about leave him alone. This is, He can be here if he wants to. I better leave him alone, yelling at the top of his lungs. Like, what is his problem? I'm asking him, what is he here for? I said, this is my yard. He said, this is a driveway. I said, this is my driveway. Why are you here? He started yelling. Brother, this is a public access driveway. No, no, that's not what I'm saying. Past all that, because honestly, he tried to give me some whatever about this being public property, property and it's not. This this yeah. whole, all of this concrete is ours. Yeah. So if she asked him to leave and he started arguing with her, I saw a video um, of what happened while she was saying, I asked him to leave and he's smirking and they yelling at me and what the kind of authority did they? And then all of a sudden she's yanked off to, to the fucking driveway and she's getting fucking beat up. Quick for safety. Pull it. I mean, an empty parking lot. Yeah. There. This not empty. This is something about a plot that she owns. But there, there's, there's she no owns. car. It is shocking. She, she called You're the police. You're not listening because, to me. I'm Man, listening it to is you because just so, much, so much stuff happening with the police now. What that, stuff? What, she, what stuff's happening? I'm talking, happening? I ain't seen you all. No, but what I'm talking about a lot of stuff happening with the police doing stuff. They're killing people. They're like, that is a young man being killed just recently. No, all, the black people are calling the police hey, each and every day. Sir, people you know, still, even though they call them, but a lot of them is still oh, afraid of y'all. I have. Because I don't met some officers that's really nasty. I don't know if you're actually and keeping I up have. with the news or anything. No, so I keep up with the news, but not only that, have, have you but I've seen... had experience with an officer myself. Okay, well, you brought I up an nice issue I wanted to bring up to you. I was calm, but he was rude and nasty, and, yeah, and you know, irritable. you know, people, people and, and can get like that. all kind of ways. Okay. So I'm saying. So she saw a police officer sitting here. She talked to him. He said he was just reading okay. emails, and that gave her the mindset of... Well, no. I'm terrified. I need to throw something at them and go no, get a gun? No, sir. No, sir. What actually happened was um, they had some type of argument. He got very loud with her. I don't know what he said, but I heard him yelling at her. Right. He just the... speaks loud normally. He's just a loud person. Okay. I understand that. Well, I was inside. And okay. I heard... I'm just telling you my what I heard. Oh, I appreciate okay. that. Okay. So keep going. I was inside, and I heard him yelling from outside. Okay. Oh. She was on the recording line, calling the recording line on purpose, letting them know I feel very fearful for my life. I feel very threatened. Uh, the cop was here. I didn't do anything to him, and he started yelling at me. And so I'm feeling very fearful, and that's why. That okay. It was a. It was a. It was. You okay. know, she was. It was a. Call why does for help. Why does she fear the police so much? Well, like I said before, sir, with everything that's going on. What's the, going on? A lot of police are killing like black people. <clears throat> Were you born here in Jacksonville? What? Okay. Were you born? You, you don't want to talk anymore. You're refusing to cooperate. Okay. Who's your niece?
If a bug got in the car, you'll be out shortly. So, interesting, I spoke to Brittany and her husband on the phone a couple of days ago, uh, and coincidentally enough, they made a, a pilot for a TV show called Illville, which had to do with police brutality. And I'm just wondering if maybe JSO caught wind of this and were trying to bait somebody into a confrontation. Uh, JSO was parked on their property. They owned that property. I don't know. Guarantee you JSO wouldn't be parked in white people's driveways. I guarantee you that for sure. And uh, when she asked that they leave, uh, they flipped out. They wound up arresting her. So real briefly, here's some of the highlights. So they try to tell her that she wasn't the property owner and had no rights telling JSO to leave the property, which was incorrect. They've been trying to say that Brittany's a danger to the community with mental illness and that she threatened them with her gun. But their own internal investigation says otherwise. Brittany is a licensed concealed carry permit holder in the state of Florida. Last time I checked, they do quite an extensive background search for mental health and for criminal records. Brittany has no history on either front, but they want to paint her how they want to paint her. Shocking, I know. There are no gun charges whatsoever. Even though the police say that they threatened her, she threatened them with a gun which is total bullshit. The gun stayed inside the home at all times. Last time I checked, gun owners are allowed to have guns in their home. And she's actually licensed to have a gun outside of her home. So uh, she writes, they stole her gun out of her house and illegally searched her home for more. And then they put the words not stolen on the police report regarding her firearm. They waited until nightfall. They took her to a dark fenced in lot and sexually intimidated her rather than immediately taking her to jail. Interestingly enough, all of that has been redacted from the body cam footage released. They redacted and muted out all of the parts where they openly conspired against Brittany. And then the sheriff's deputy put bugs in the back seat with Brittany to try to make her appear crazy. Because that's one of the big go-tos for really crazy people, right? Is that there are bugs all over the place and there's bugs on me. That's like mental health crisis 101, right? Interestingly enough, he just happened to have bugs in his trunk that he put in the back seat. Almost like he was waiting for this type of an event to present itself. So I'm going to be reaching out to Jeffrey Gray. Let him know about this. Please feel free to share Brittany's video. Not this version of the video. Share Brittany's video directly. Or share her link on any social media that you have or YouTube. This is a really disturbing case. She's got three charges against her. Level three felony, which is resisting an officer with violence to his person. This one was dropped. The second is another level three felony, which is battery on a law enforcement officer. And she has another level three felony of battery on a law enforcement officer. So I'm going to put the IMDB link to um, the TV show that Brittany created, produced. It was produced at the end of 2019 before the police showed up in her driveway. This all took place May 13th, 2020. Uh, Illville is a dramatic satire about the psychology behind police officers that commit police brutality and the effects it has on society. These are Brittany's words.
She was invited all the way to Cannes, France, for her film to be screened a month before the police showed up in her driveway. Leave a comment. You guys think that the police knew who she was and were just trying to bait her? Or you think it was just coincidence? Thanks so much, you guys. Um, share this video and uh, get Brittany and her husband's story out there. Thanks.